And we're gonna be handing this over to Niels. I think he's gonna be very excited. Hi Niels. Hey. This is your beast. Welcome back everybody to Monaco. And I'm sitting on my fully electric energetic bike because today I'm handing it over to the winner of our project fundraise. Maybe you'll remember we raised together 100,000 euros for kids, who, kids in need in Germany and for the Italian Red Cross uh, in this difficult Corona time. So 100,000 euros, thanks to you, thank you so much. And we're gonna be handing this over to Niels. I'm now going to be telling the winner of my high performance electric motorbike. Hallo Nils, du hast gewonnen! Du hast das Motorrad gewonnen! I'm losing words right now. He made the trip all the way down from Germany. We invited him. I think he's going to be very excited. So let's get, go and say hi to him. <laughs> oh. Hi Nils. Hey. Thank you so much for making the trip. Huh? Yeah, so this is your beast. Wow. It's, uh, it's all yours. And you came with your, your family, or yeah, what? Yeah, they're with me, yeah. No, that's so cool. Yeah. So I'm happy that finally we can do the handover after yeah. all these months. So Anis, if it's okay, I explain uh, quickly a few things about the motorbike. First of all, of course, quite a lot of carbon that's been used to try and get the weight down as much as possible. Uh, range is 100 kilometers. Acceleration is pretty big. Yeah. So be, be careful with the, with the power. Yeah. <laughs> when, you, when you get going design, it's like, I, I don't know, I, I quite like just black with, uh, or gray with some, some red highlights. Um, that's what I wanted to go for. Number plate, please do put your own one on. Yeah. Otherwise, I'll keep getting uh, fines all tickets, the time here. Yeah. I'll keep getting the tickets <laughs> from Germany here sent to Monaco. So please do put your own one on. Yeah. Your, uh, your wife or partner can go on the back. If she, <laughs> if she dares, if she dares. Vivian, Vivian hasn't dared yet, but it's there just in case. I hear your, your daughter is also very excited. Yeah, she is. <laughs> to get going, it's pull the brake. You push the, push the start button there, yeah. that engages the forward. And if you want to reverse, it also has a reverse. You again put the brake start button, it goes into reverse. Yeah, so this was amazing. I, I couldn't imagine it. Like waiting here in the sun and apparently Nico just rushed in your brake and now I'm standing here next to the bike looking at it. The pictures were crazy, but seeing it in real life is just overwhelming. So everything so far is amazing. So your 100,000 euros went 50,000 to the Red Cross in Italy, 50,000 to Projekt Nestwärme in Germany. The German project was about helping kind of impaired children or Ill, ch Ill children in this difficult time, especially also with the journeying, you know, with COVID and everything really tough. And I actually went to visit Projekt Nestwärme in Germany and it's shocking. I mean, one, one child was, was born, she's growing up with a grandmother. The grandmother, of course, at, at her limit in terms of being able to drive her every single day to this, to this home for the care that she needs. And, Wow, so um, it's, it's really some, some tough stories and, and again there that we were able to support the grandmother then also, also with the one-to-one -one psychological coaching and mentoring and supporting and everything. Um, it's, it's very, very valuable. So again, I can just say a huge thank you. In Italy, we, were support, we, we gave out 14,116 vouchers, which helped 352 families in Italy get proper meals. So uh, in this COVID time where many people were struggling to be able to purchase their food. Um, so really, we, we helped so many people um, in, in Germany and Italy, so thank you very much. Huh? 100,000 euros that we raised, that is so epic, really uh, much more than we would have thought, so really appreciate it. So Nils, next up, uh, as part of the prize, I had said that I'll also, if you're willing to do it or if you want to do it, we can go in the Audi e-tron. I take you around the Formula One trap, I tell you all the secrets yeah. that nobody else in the world knows how to do the fast lap. We can do some sideways drifting, no, just kidding. <laughs> you up for it? Yes, I am. Let's do it. Let's do it, yeah. So, dann fahren wir mal los. Ja. Antonia, bist du bereit? Are you ready? Wir machen jetzt Brumm Brumm. Nico Brumm Brumm. <lacht> jetzt kommt Nico Brumm Brumm. So, Antonia, jetzt geht's auf die Formel 1 Strecke. So, hier ist die Pole Position. We do a flying start. So, hier, and the lights are right above. Ja. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> a smooth one. Yeah, that was a smooth one for Antonia. So, this is the, this is the legendary Casino Square with all the beautiful cars. Yeah, I can see that. Look, Antonia, a Lamborghini Urus. Is it flat out? 
This is flat out, yeah. 320. So I guess during the races, they're way more yachts than right now. It's I guess. full. This is uh, more, more the yacht, my, the billionaire's mile. Yeah. <laughs> full of boats. So Antonia, Antonia is about to fall asleep. So that's a big compliment to my driving uh, skills. Why you started investing in renewable energies and all those investment projects you're having? For me, this is my path towards a greater contribution. Um, because contributing is something that I missed out on when I was young. I didn't really see it or understand the importance of it. Um, and now I, I really made myself a promise and I, I want to, in everything I do, make sure that I contribute, that many people can benefit from what I'm doing. Um, not only then for the others, but also because I myself will feel proud. Um, and it will be great for my well-being in my life as well. And, and one of my big goals is also to hopefully manage to inspire my kids. Antonia? <laughs> I drove so well that uh, she fell asleep after two minutes, the baby. snoring in the background. Okay, and I'm really thankful. Uh, Debbie Schenker is our partner uh, for the logistics, and Debbie Schenker is one of the leading logistics providers in the world. They are massive, hundreds and thousands of employees, and they're doing the first and last mile, so the delivery from here to the big center is fully electric with the e-truck, and also in Cologne it will be fully electric with the e-truck. So DB Schenker is really doing flat out electrifying their fleet, so that's very cool. So as green as possible, the transport, which I'm very proud of, and the bike is in there as we speak. Now let's go say bye to Niels. Signing the, I'm signing the contract, Niels. After this, there's no way back, huh? Okay, no way back. Look, it's already, it's already yours. The signature is on there. Hey Niels, Hi. these are your keys now. Thanks. Enjoy. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, <laughs> let's go. Ja, <lacht> krass. Total verrückt. So this is Project Fundraise. Thanks to you we raised 100,000 euros, helped children and families in need, and we really had a big impact. I'm so grateful and can't wait for the next one, so please stay tuned.